come the stars come Hey beautiful mamas, welcome back. I have a new bag video for you today. My husband got me this beauty for my birthday and I'm so excited to share it with you. It's the perfect size, it doubles as a wallet and it's neutral enough to go with everything. It's so beautiful. I love it, it's my new obsession, so let's get into it. I wanna make sure that I'm providing value for you. I love making these videos about bags. So if there's any sort of topic regarding these bags that you feel like I'm not covering, please let me know in the comments below. I wanna cover what fits in here, so we'll go through what's in my bag. We, I also like to show you what it looks like on the body, talk about durability. I actually have had a few bags from this brand for a while now, over a year. So I wanna talk about durability, and I also wanna talk about just how cute this bag is. So let's get into it. Oh, also, in case you're wondering, these uh, accessories here, I have a tassel and a keychain on here, are from Reese Co. and Mouse on Main Street. So cute. And there's the tassel. All right, so let's get into it. This bag is by Rad Rev. It is the crossbody sling. So there is an older version of this bag that's the wallet. I'll show you that and we'll compare. Ooh, also, I like to do size comparisons, so we'll be sure to show you size comparison with the mini and with the full-size OG. I like to just give you an idea in case you own one of those bags, then you can, you can see what they look like compared to each other. Okay, so this is the original wallet. And they're about, this one is bigger, but they're about the same, kind of the same shape. This one's flat across the top and comes to a point on top. It's rounded all the way around on this one. But if you look at the side, that's where you're gonna see the biggest difference right here. So, definitely a big difference with how much it can hold. I'll show you what can fit in this. It has two pockets, one main front pocket here. Beautiful studs. I have noticed with this, if we're talking about the durability of it, on my old one, it's super scratched because I keep it in my purse. It's really scratched up, so. That is a potential problem. Maybe be careful, <laughs> be gentle with the little clasp right here. Um, the front has these beautiful studs. Those are fine. Those haven't gotten all banged up. Give you all the close-ups. Here's the front pocket. So you've got card slots, four card slots in the front. Middle, you have three more card slots. Got some gum in there still. And then it has a second pocket right here. The zippers are great on these. And then it has this zippered pocket inside the second part. Just like a little change pouch right there. And then the back, the clasps come on like this on the oak one. But she just launched a lilac version of this. She's changing this part on all of her new bags so that it comes out to the side a little bit more so that it's more comfortable to wear as a belt bag. So if that's how you wanna wear this bag, there are, the new ones are more accommodating for that, but this one's fine. So the back here just attaches like this. So you can attach it to your belt or you could wear it across your body this way or you can put it across your body, wear it down here on your hip. It's, it's very versatile. It goes with all of your cute outfits. All right, let's go through what can fit in this bag. Let's pack it up. Um, also, I did, I do own the corduroy version of this. I filmed a video and I didn't ever post it because I was like, well, I don't know if anyone wants to watch this anymore. She did, I think she still has that bag. I'll have to look and see. But I was able to fit a diaper and wipes in that bag. So I can fit diapers in here, no problem. But I think you'd have to have a really small pack of wipes to fit in here. Ooh, I see one, hold on. Of course, there's just one right here on my living room floor. Okay, let's see. It's not very cool, but it's got some. And you can fit that in there, so if you really needed to bring diaper and wipes in this bag, you can. Zips up just fine. So if, that, if that's something that you, you just wanna go with one baby, you're set. But I, when I brought it the other day, I brought my, this is by Les, Les G. It's all dirty because it's been floating around in my bag and I am constantly carrying it around. But this is the phone, portable phone charger that has like, I'm sure you've seen this. I feel like everyone, everybody on Instagram shares this. But it has all three cords. 
So you have this micro USB, um, USB-C, and the Apple cord all attached to this. So it's nice because my husband has an iPhone and I have a Samsung and we can both use this. I'll put it in the description box below. Anything that you're looking for that you see in a video usually is linked in the description box. If it's not, let me know and I'll put it in there. Okay, I can fit little baby toys in here too. Like this, Itsy Ritzy Rattle, which is adorable. My baby's teething right now, so we need all the, all the silicone things. So that's what's nice about this, it's silicone. This you can find, I think, at Target, but itsyritzy.com has the best little baby toys. They're all so cute. That's what this one's from too. Look at this. Sorry, I'm just gonna do like a show and tell because I just, there's just so many fun things I wanna share with you. Uh, my daughter's ran off with the ring that holds it onto her car seat, <laughs> but it's so cute. It's like crinkly. And then this is a little silicone teether right here and it rattles. And it's got these fun little clinky stars right here. So I like to carry that around so I can put my baby down, let her play. She's 10 months old now. I can't even believe that. Also, if you're new here, Hi, I'm Jessica Gish and I have four daughters and they range from ages seven down to 10 months. I feel like the older kids, I don't have to carry very many, very many things for them, but the baby takes up all of my purse space. So I just packed up a few, some gum, lip gloss. This is my favorite lip gloss right now. It's Man Eater by Tarte. It's called Moth. The color is just Moth. We'll get a few cards so i got my cards here lip gloss gum what else i need to cram more things in so you guys can see oh yeah my knife obviously so i always carry a knife because i'm obsessed with knives i like that this has this little front slot right here so that if i'm wearing my sunglasses these are the kind that gets stuck in your hair i love these ones these are by key and i got these during the nordstrom sale because i don't want to pay full price for sunglasses because they're so expensive and my kids get a hold of them and they do this little number where they pull these out to the side and destroy them. And I'm sure if you have kids, you know what I'm talking about. So these can go right here or if you don't want them to touch those studs. Keys and Tylenol. I honestly don't carry very much. If I am carrying a purse this small, it's because I want to break from my giant diaper bag. So. There we go. It's packed up. That's how I would carry it. Let me give you a more, a better close-up of what I have in this bag. Also, this color is called Oak. It is gorgeous. And the texture on this bag, every time I get in a Rad Rev bag, the texture is better and better. So this one actually has, can you see that? It has such a nice leather feel to it. The inside has these black and white stripes that they look busy on camera, but they actually make it really nice to see all of your stuff. We've got pen, lip gloss, Tylenol, knife, gum, like five sticks of gum, keys. I have my phone and portable phone charger. I love this case. This case is from Loopy, obviously. This one's so pretty. I was so hesitant to get this one because I thought the glitter wasn't going to be quite glittery enough, but it's really nice. And it's smooth, it doesn't feel like chunky glitter sandpaper. Okay, let's go over size comparison really quick. My everyday carry is this Rad Rev OG. It's the best diaper bag, I think. I don't know, because my Itsy Ritzy is so good too. Okay, so this and the Itsy Ritzy Mini, if you have that bag, I made a video, I'll put a card for that right up here. But the Itsy Ritzy Mini is my other obsession. I have it in the uh, cognac color and the black. But this, Hold everything. This bag is like the perfect size. I have enough unpopular opinion to share. I don't, I don't like the Itsy Ritsy Moss bag. I know, I'm sorry. I think it's beautiful, but it's so freaking huge and I don't wanna carry it. And I, I put it on and I'm like, I feel like I'm going back to high school. This just feels miserable. So this is like a smaller version, but it's bigger than the Itsy Ritsy Mini, which I needed because I now have four kids and one of them is a baby who's still breastfeeding and in diapers. My 
three-year-old, she just turned three, is now potty trained, so I don't have to carry stuff for her. So I think pretty soon I'm gonna be able to downsize and I'm excited to carry the Rad Rev crossbody. I think I posted a video about that. If I didn't, I will make sure to link it. That bag I did film a video for, but it's gorgeous. I got the navy one and she's put that one on sale a couple of times. If you don't follow Mallory Boren on Instagram, you should, um, or Rad Rev Kids on Instagram. She is amazing. Her, She's the one who designs all of these bags. And she just launched a lilac version of this that is so gorgeous. So you should go check that out. Also, she just barely relaunched the black version of this bag that is the double zippered pouch one. It's also gorgeous and it sells out very fast. So she's busy restocking those. She's always putting restocks in. If it sells out, then wait. Every single Monday is a new launch day for her, for Rad Rev. So just follow them. Maybe sign up for the emails. Things don't go on sale very often, but it's also a mom, it's a small business. It's just her and then one other woman who works with her and they are the people shipping, doing the social media, doing all, doing everything, the designing. So if you buy a bag from this company, you're buying from a small business, woman owned. Size comparison with the Rad Revs. I got way, way sidetracked with that, sorry. So here's the, OG, and then I'll show you with the mini. Okay, whoa. Here's the mini. So this can fit inside the mini. I'll show you what that looks like. It can also fit inside the OG. The smaller wallet can fit inside the front pouch, which is a nice, so it can fit inside this part of the bag. But the bigger one, this is a little too thick. When I have stuff in it, I can't fit it in there. All right, so here's this inside here. It's so hard to show you. Okay, here we go. So that's what it looks like down in there. It actually doesn't take up nearly as much room as you would think, so that's kind of nice. And this is the Red Rev Mini in cor cream corduroy. This one I also love. I, she just launched a mini version of this bag. So if you have seen my Itsy Ritsy mini bag video, then you'll know that my only problem with this bag is that it doesn't have the side pockets. She just made one that's the mini version of that bag exactly. And it has the side pockets. This is just where I stick my phone all the time. This hasn't been a problem though. I just stick the phone in this pocket right here. So if you're looking for, some good options, I would check out Rad Rev. My other favorite diaper bag brands are Jujubee. Um, they have that Million Pockets bag that's gorgeous. The Itsy Ritsy has their mini and their boss bag. If you're an overpacker, you will like, you'll probably like this. But you, if you're a way overpacker, then the Itsy Ritsy boss. Jujubee has their BRB, which is great if you like to pack a lot of things for your baby. Um, they have smaller bags too, but I don't like that they don't have as much organization and they're not as structured. So I think the Million Pockets, they're more structured leather type, the leather type bags are my favorites. There's always Lily Jade, but I feel like they're crazy expensive. They are really nice bags though. So if you're willing to splurge, that is a good option for like a long term. It's gorgeous. I like their Anna backpack a lot. So there's the Anna, their Anna medium and their Anna large. I don't think there's an Anna small. It just, they haven't made it yet. I have no idea. But the interiors are really pretty on those. They're light blue color. They're easy to find what you're looking for inside those ones. I love Jujube because they're constantly coming out with new fun prints. Um, I'm actually gonna be making a video about my favorite pool bag for when I take my kids to the pool, which is all summer long. And that, I had a couple of options there. So I'll be making a video for that coming right up. Um, I'm trying to think of my other favorite diaper bag brands. I did like Rad Pack, I don't know. I never got fully sold on their bag because the interior pockets were a little tricky for me, but they've changed it. So check out Rad Pack, that's another great one if you're looking for a diaper bag that's a little more high-end looking. I don't, I don't want my diaper bag to look like a diaper bag. <laughs> I want it to look classy and like a nice purse. So that's usually what I'm looking for. Um, there was Orchid Hearts, but I feel like they've kind of gone in a different direction with their bags. So they are still one to check out, but I 
feel like their bags aren't quite the same. They're not what they were. I feel like they were a little more, I don't know. I'm just gonna shut my mouth because they're gonna put something out that's gonna be amazing and I'm gonna be eating my words. So all of those ones I like a lot. You know, there's a lot of really good ones on Amazon. I did make a video about one not too long ago that I liked a lot. That one was, had a built-in bassinet and was really durable on the outside and it was waterproof. So those are some good options if you're also looking for a diaper bag, check those out. I'm constantly looking for a new, new bag. I shouldn't say that, I need to stop buying bags. This, was a, this one was a present from my husband and I was so excited, he was like, no, because he happened to mention, like, is there something you're wanting for your birthday? And I was like, yes, the new Rad Rad bags. He was like, no more diaper bags. And I was like, but I love it. So um, let me know if there's a new one or a brand that you feel like I haven't covered that you would like to see me cover, please let me know. And don't forget to stay for some on the body shots. I will put these right after this and I will let you know what it looks like on a real person. That was a rambly what's in my bag. I love this bag video, but I hope you enjoyed it. If you are new here, I am obsessed with all things bags, <laughs> but also I make videos about motherhood, especially the holidays. I love Halloween. Halloween is like my favorite, I don't know. It's tied with Christmas, but we love Halloween around here and I have a lot of fun things that I love to do for Halloween. We have some fun traditions that we do and I wanna share those with you. Also, I wanna take you through decorating my house and I have some fun seasonal things to share with you that just, I just love to feel fully immersed in whatever holiday it is. And since Halloween is coming up, I wanted to share some of my favorite things with you, including like what my favorite books are for Halloween, some fun Halloween decor, some of our favorite traditions for Halloween. Um, I have some unconventional ones. Also, just, I just want you to also feel fully immersed in Halloween and all the exciting things. So if that's something that you wanna see, then please hit the subscribe button below and don't miss another one of my videos. I am trying to grow my channel right now, so it really helps me out. Also, if you can hit the like button and the subscription, the subscribe button, it doesn't cost you a thing. Just hit that button and then it'll notify you if you hit the bell when I make a new video. So don't forget to do that. And thank you so much for being here. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye, have a great day.